let's go. Let's get right into it. You leave that puck right there. You can get rid of that puck. No, no, yeah, that oh. no, yeah, that's right. Go back to the middle where you are. Let's see if I'm set up here, right? Yeah. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna go butterfly, and whatever leg you get up with, you're going butterfly slide the opposite direction. So if you get up with your left leg, you're going to the right post. Okay. And you're gonna come back up on your skates. Set, no rush. Butterfly, get up with your right leg. Butterfly, slide down to the left post. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, left post. Alright, go. No, no paddle down, butterfly slide. That's it. You don't, every time you're at the high point of the crease, you don't go paddle down slide. You can go do that once in a, once in a while. Once in a while, post to post. But you can't go to a slide like that. You gotta maintain chest on that side. Ready? Go. Okay, good. Now, real fast, you probably, you'll see a video unless you don't pick it up. When you go to your butterfly, you're putting your glove right through your logo like this, sideways. Your, your chest and gloves should be quiet. So when you go down and recover, you don't bring your gloves through your chest. Keep it up. Right. Go. That's it. Good. Good. Go. Good. Up. Go. Go. Last one. Good, not bad at all. Good job with your stick. Good job with the turn. Good job with the slide. Now, you're gonna start on the puck right here on your skates all the time. You're gonna go stand center to stick side post, turn pivot out, shot. Okay. All right, I wanna see a good movement. Now, from where you just were. Uh, Lined up to that puck, yes. Okay. When you come through, remember, you're not gonna be able to dictate the, uh, the end. Challenge point, I am. So you gotta be able to have your feet set and get ready for the shot. Go. Go. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. It's a high shot. No need to go butterfly slide or half butterfly or anything like that. Stay on your skates. Stop. Take the shot. Make the save. No slide here. Too far out. Go. 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 
examine the other side. Push. push out, one push. One push, pads, face, puck. T pushing is the only blue line, the blue line. Or if you're going to go from a higher area than that to go to the post. Other than that, I want to see one good push. Grab over with the pads and the T push. Go. Save. Go. Go. 
Officer Pope checks, please. say it's like the 18 minute mark on the count. Parallel as possible. Jones in the puck as much as possible. Don't in the net. 
go. Up, long leg. You saw in, probably two, three feet. On top of the puck. On top of the puck. Alright? Get on top of the puck.
the glove up when you track the puck, when you're shuffling. I don't want to see the back part of your glove ever. I want to see the cheater part in the palm. Go. That stick closer to your pad when you do your half butterfly on both sides. Okay. Two more. The glove side? On both sides. Okay. Just like turn. There you go. Turn right into that. And we want to make sure that you keep your body weight forward. If you're turning and you feel like you're in the middle, it's not good enough. I want it forward. Back side or, or in the middle is not good enough. I want it forward. Go. That's good. That was your best one. Up, 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 up. Bring that stick a little bit more to the pad next time and you get that side. This side. Go. See what I'm saying? Do you feel your body weight go to your butt? Okay, you're gonna do both of them again. Go. Now stay down, stay down. Now look at your body weight. You feel like you're forward or backward? That's where I don't want you to be. Like that? Yeah, you're gonna push into it. Yep, definitely. Okay? You're an ex it's an extension save. Extend. Go. Bring your stick close to your pad. The blade part. No, on the ice. Like that. Turn. Puck, you do a shuffle. Everything's gonna be outside. Left leg. So you're gonna make a half butterfly save. Whether okay. you go pull back or a extension, that's up to you. It's your safe slash. Whatever you do again. Okay? Go. Body weight. Yeah. Where's your glove? Where's your hip? Face to the shot, lift, turn, extend into it like I told you to, and you should allow your body, or your body should allow you to stay on top of the puck because you're ready for the next shot. If by chance it doesn't go where you want it to, it should, you can your stick on the ice, but just in case you have to be ready for the next shot. Go! Up. Go. Up. That's not bad. Wrong leg. Go. Best one, right? Why was that your best one? In my body weight forward, stick on the ice. What else? Was, did you T push or did you shuffle? Shuffle. Stay on top of the puck. 
possible so you got down the middle right at you as long as you're skating back slow enough Luke you can keep the puck in front of you keep the puck in above your chest or feel like you're on top of it easy say right down the middle all right after the shooters come down on you they take they take you to the left or right post break away break away break away as soon as you see them go off this way you go to the puck player or post Yes. Because. Exactly right. You gotta 
to maintain that stance and that space between you that you still feel like you're on top of the puck. You can, not too close, but close enough where if he goes short side, you can go that way. If he turns around, Okay, right down the middle, keep your stick on the ice, keep your stance, feel like you're on top of the puck. Right down the middle and they take you to the glove side, you go puck player or post, which one is it? Post. All the time, every time, doesn't change. Same thing going to stick side, what side is it? Stick side, what post is it? It's gotta be the short side post. If you see them turn and your defense is still not back, then you can be aggressive with the stick, but you can only poke check that puck if they're in the blue area. All right, because then you still are allowed to, you're still able to get another shot or another another shot of the safe selection anyway. If your D is that bad, so maintain stance the whole entire time. Keep your skating so you're able to turn left or right, and maintain patience until it's in the blue, and then you can try doing a poke check. You got to keep the stick on the ice. Your body weight's got to stay in the stick, not in your butt.